Hi. Really wish I had a cat here. Cat's on top of the battery backup as usual. Let's go ahead and jump to the next sector. Zoltan Homeworlds or Civilian Sector. Once more, it's one of those you should always go with the ones that you have crew of. I don't have any Zoltan crew. I would love to have Zoltan crew right about now, but I don't have any. So I'm going to go to the Civilian Sector instead. to connect the three. I'm going to go up here first. Aww. You jump into the middle of a plasma storm. Multiple recently incapacitated ships loom in the shadows, briefly illuminated by lightning. We can either avoid the risk and wait to jump away unscathed, or manually search the record wreckage for survivors and equipment. We're going to search. Among the junk and scrap, you find a salvageable drone schematic. You decide to quit while ahead and prepare to jump with your recent find. 30 scrap and a defense drone mark two. I like defense drones. Yeah, just put something in oxygen, please. Uh, yep. Gonna jump. Four fuel for three missiles? That sounds awesome, please. Pretty please with sugar on top, even. We actually have a decent amount of scrap now. I think we should probably start upgrading the ship. So I've talked about that I want to upgrade both of those, but I also need some more power. And my engines are terrible. I'm not even dodging things 100% of the time with cloak. We'll do that. Okay, right. jump down there. Hopefully get some more fuel. Auto surveyor with mind control. This is gonna suck. I'm only gonna be able to use the hull laser, unfortunately. I'm powering up its FTL drive. To do mind control. Oh, great engines. Ugh. All right. Borrow from that. Power up hull laser. Oh dear, that thing looks nasty. I'm gonna have to hit your weapon system. Maybe I should teleport somebody over there now that I think about it. Complete life support, power to... Hmm. Teleportation, I guess. And we're going to bring the two of you on board, because you two don't actually take as much damage. You're going to teleport over to Helm. Ooh, it missed. Good. All right, you succeeded at taking that out. And now the whole laser is actually going to hit. Go ahead and move over to there. Oof. Did not want to actually hit myself, but I did. Okay, we can now teleport them back. Which I'm going to do shortly. I want to beat up that a little bit more if I can. Good. That's what I wanted to have happen. Please. I can depower that by one. <clears throat> Please return to teleportation bay one. Go in for healing, which I can now provide. Oh yeah, whole laser, how about you keep firing? <laughs> Good. See, I can actually fight an auto scout finally. Or an auto surveyor in this case, but that's fine. Right. And just report back to quarters. We're done. Just hit their engines just because. Hmm. 
brought their piloting back on because they regenerate quickly. The ship breaks apart and you feel relief in the knowledge that you will hopefully still be one step ahead of the fleet. We actually can take on auto scouts. Maxwell, please report for Med Bay. Thank you. Felicity, please stop getting mind controlled. I know it doesn't work that way, but you know, I'm asking nicely. Go into the next nebula. Oh, it's another lightning storm. And there's intruders on board. In the teleportation room. Well, you're a fool. I can outdo damage from anybody in the group. And I have a med bay, so I'm fine with doing damage. Also, let's just power oxygen so I don't have problems. Well, thank you for the experience. Felicity, Justin, and Maxwell, please report in there. Magne, I'm going to have you just run back and forth. And everybody's healed. Please report back to your original stations. Uh, we don't need the weapons up. I would rather have shields online. So there's a method to my madness as to why I power things the way I do. I should probably explain that. Um, whenever I'm in a lightning storm or a situation where I have low power... Um, even if there's no enemies nearby, I power up shields first, weapons second. The reason for that is that it takes time for them to turn on. Shields will actually stay up, so if I have two shields right now, I will have two shields when I jump in. If I'm down to one shield, I will have to regenerate that other shield. Yeah, jump in. And I could be taking damage during that time, so I don't want to do that. Instead, I just keep them powered up. Weapons, it's something similar. Even without a pre-igniter, which I would definitely want to keep powered up, um, I want to power weapon systems when I can. That way, it will start charging the moment I come in, so I get one extra tick of charge, basically. It's not much, it's just better than nothing. Alright, I'm going to jump down here. Surprisingly lack of number of stores here so far. Number of ships convening around a station. Some unencrypted chatter between the ships. You tune in and listen for anything interesting. Overhearing their conversation, it seems that they need to take possession of an enemy ship intact. Well, I do have this teleporter. They quickly stand your ship and say, it's It appears that you can help. A bandit has made off with some very important cargo, though I doubt they have any understanding as to what they stole. We needed to capture this ship intact. So this is only available when you have a teleporter. I think there's a couple of other blue techs that work. We'll help. Remember, do not destroy the ship. But we need to make sure we do not destroy the ship. Do not destroy the ship. Where is it at? Oh. Well, luckily, I've been diving through Nebula, so I have time. I'm going to be a little tight on fuel, but I have time. Uh, speaking of, let's go ahead and start upgrading some more things. I want the ability to be able to use the halberd beam, even if I decide against it. For auto scouts, the halberd beam would have been way better than the hull laser. Um, and really, I just need more power. We'll do that. So now I can go like that, or power up a weapon. All right, two, three, four, five, probably. One moment. All right, I'm back. Uh, housemate needed something. All right, let's go up here. We've got a ship. A well-armed pirate ship approaches you. Hand over one of your crew members and the rest of you will go free unharmed. Uh, no. Okay, so they're going to teleport over with a rock. They're an idiot. I will just teleport over with the rest of my crew.
because I have enough crew where one border is not going to do anything. Make sure that they're fighting a human instead. Teleport over to there. Maxwell, go ahead and lock down. Cloak to avoid. taking damage a little too fast. Let's swap them at this point. Unfortunately, they teleported back in time, but this should not be a big deal. And they're only firing one pew pew at this point, so I don't care. Right? I'm not red. I'm green. I was like, wait, I'm about to die. No, wait. No, I'm fine. All right. Find a number of slaves in the cargo hold. They look at you questioningly, and one asks if they are to be released. You can use more crew, but you don't want to force them to do all the work for you. Instead, so I can get a Mantis to join me, a Rockman to join me, or an Engi to join me. I would much prefer a second Mantis. I really miss the first Mantis that I lost. And it's one that's good at fighting. Yes. Mantis seems fine with the order, saying, I'm on board if it means we get to kill some rebels. You drop the rest off at a nearby station. All right. Who am I getting rid of then? Kind of prefer having the human so it's probably going to be one of those two, and really, I don't... Actually, I'm going to get rid of the human. The reason being that I can get more green text this way, because diversity. Diversity is great. Green text. Blue text. So sorry, Tomas. Alright, let's bring our crew members back. Ten... Everybody go back to stations, I should say. Starker. Anybody actually good with weapons at all? Justin has used weapons before. That's it. Oh no, not even. Nobody has used weapons before. Um, oh yeah, Justin... Uh, let me get people to correct positioning. Um... Honestly, I think that I should be repositioning some people. Heal up. I'm thinking that it might actually be time for me to truly have people in position. Maxwell's actually fully maxed out on things. Yeah, we can go like that, because I can always have one of them run over to weapons to run that. Although the lack of people in door control hurts. I'm going to go without door control. All right, we've got a quest coming up. Let's do this. I have no idea what this quest is. I've never looked. You find the ship that you were asked to capture intact. Not sure why, but they stress that it's of great importance that you kill the crew without destroying the ship. There's a freaking cloning bay. All right. Teleport in. I really hope... Justin, just start your lockdown now. The 
The cloning bay is the pro problem. Go ahead, cloak. If I kill them fast enough, it won't be that big of a deal, right? Doing okay on hit points so far. One of them just came back, unfortunately. Oh, I should have locked them down there. Darn it. I just lost one. Damn it. I thought I was fine. Mm. Got distracted and was looking over there instead of there. It's my own fault. Uh, game. Why you do this? Cloak's on fire. Cool. We're gonna cloak now. Oh, everybody goes there. We're running away. Looking system is down. Great. I lost a Mankey again, or lost a Mantis again because I wasn't paying attention. They're going to start getting people back shortly, and that was a horrible failure. Have been paying more attention. They're up to three crew already. Damn it, me. We're reboarding. We're not going without. You are immediately going to lock down. We need to take that area out now. The ten, you are going to there. We need that cloak back. All right, we've at least damaged cloning. You're going on a walk. All right, cloning is actually damaged. Good. Okay. Cloning's damaged. We need to heal up again. Really wish I would have had better healing, but I don't. All right. Teleport back in. Lockdown. Wrong room. Damn it. I'm not gonna, and that mantis isn't gonna survive. I do that. Damn it, that did not work. Return. Heal up. At least they're leveling. I'm grinding. That helps, right? 
Well, I'm already at max, but you know. Be nice if I had better healing abilities. All right. Yep, they're all back to normal already. Piece of crap. Okay. Actually, the Mantis is going to stay, and I'm going to teleport just the two crystal in. Because I could lock down that room, and then lock it down again afterward. Teleport in there. You're injured. Damn it, teleporter's on fire. Piece of crap. Everybody go fix that. You need to run. Oh, piece of crap. Teleporter's down. This is not good. And Maxwell is very heavily injured. Cloak. This is going poorly. I might be able to do this. I think I've got it. Oh! You secure the ship and wait for the merchants to arrive. Upon your arrival, they message you saying, Good job. We would prefer if you did not speak of this to anyone. We get 50 scrap, which is really nice, and a burst laser mark one. Burst laser is probably better for me than the hull laser. We'll take a peek in a moment. Everybody back to stations. I will order the three of you to go heal. Do you need badly? Let's take a look at our new weapon. Burst laser one fires off two shots per charge. It only deals one point of damage each, and charge time's 11 seconds. Hull laser one is... Three seconds longer for an extra damage. Okay, yeah, hull laser is probably better for us. But it's nice to have the option. Also, it means if we get a fourth power into weapons, we can run both of them and, you know, deal with things a little faster. Unfortunately, we lost a character again. Dang it. I just gained back my second Mantis. No. That's okay. I'll survive. It just sucks. Right, everybody go back to stations, where I just realized I did not actually set up my stations correctly. Yeah, I guess it'll just be the three of you prepped. Save stations. Oh yeah, you need to actually be in sensors. I like being able to see when I'm, you know, boarding strategy. Okay, I actually have plenty of time, it looks like. I'm going to run out of fuel first. Let's hit here, just in case if that's a store that might actually be worth going to still. Is it? Would it be? No, it wouldn't be. I wouldn't go there. All right. Rebel ship moves in to engage. You attempt to open communications, but realize the futility of that action when you see that the ship is run by an AI. We've got mind control again. Yay. Uh, this is the point where Helbert Beam is probably our best bet. Oh, and it's charging up its FTL drive. And one of the people it mind controlled is one that I wanted to board. Great. 
Um, two of you are going to teleport into weapons control. Adrian, you're going to distract. Also, it'd probably help if I actually use powered up weaponry. Just saying. All laser it is. Hopefully damage it a little bit before I leave. Okay. Barely finished off that. Because I kept forgetting to actually do anything with that. My mistake. Ready to go back to positions. Felicity and Maxwell, please report to Medbay. And the rest are going to go to piloting just in case if they try to repair it because they're about to teleport out. That would be scary. Okay. Nothing else I can do right now other than heal. Oh, damn it. They got their freaking thing back online. Oh, crap. I'm gonna just eat the damage for now. I just realized that Justin was extremely low on hit points. Done. At least I got fuel. Oh. Don't like auto scouts. Okay. Now that Justin's healed up, everybody, please report back to your original positions. We are going to hit the store. Yes. Yes, please. Ship engineer has set up a small shop here. Explosive replicator would be useful if we used missiles. We don't. Emergency respirators are only useful when we decide that... I think that only works on ship. Reverse ion field protects us from ion damage, which is not necessarily bad. I'm thinking we should pick up hacking... Because hacking is awesome. We can also pick up some weapons. Breach bombs are nice. They're slow. But they do a lot of system damage and breach chance. So they're really useful for certain scenarios. There is that chain ion though. Is it seriously the final slot? I guess it is. Hacking it is. Like that. Oh, that's right. There's stuff I can sell. Derp. Like, for instance, I don't have a defense system. Maybe I should have gone with drone control, actually. Oh, well, that's fine. Meryl, Nancy, you want to join us in this video? I think the internet would love another kitty. The internet always loves kitties. Okay, so that means I could probably afford an augmentation if I sell some of this. I mean, I would definitely prefer the... Do I want to sell the... Oops, sorry. Did not mean to poke you in the face soon. Asian kitty. On zone. Um... 
Burst laser is going to be nice when I start fighting Zoltan shield things, which the final boss has a Zoltan shield, so we need to be worried about that. Um, Halberd beam's always nice, but it's so slow. He's full of purrs, yay. Um, what's the likelihood that I would actually end up using this? And I love the halberd beam. It's one of the best weapons in the game, and it's always nice to have a beam weapon. But I'm not really using weapons that much. I'll just stick with it as is. Go here, then there, then there, I think. You find an abandoned mining station on a nearby moon. Quick scan shows no life forms. However, you do discover a usable drone schematic. Because I need even more drones. Uh. Cool, I guess. Going there. Stumble across a forward scout of the rebel fleet. Okay. They have a teleporter, so they're going to come to say hi. You should go run over to drone control. However, they are powering up FTL drive. You're not going to go to drone control. You're going to stop by doors. Now let them teleport. We're going to go teleport over to their room here. We will include you. Look at both rooms. Maxwell, lockdown. Look. Oof, piloting got hit. That's not good. While I'm cloak too, just because. <sighs> um. Well, since piloting's down anyway, let's go ahead and start hacksawing them. Uh, hacksaw weapons, please. I don't need that. Start hacksawing the weapons, drain the weapons down so I don't have to care about it. Okay, their piloting is dead. The two of you are moving to weapons. Two of you are also moving to weapons. They're attacking my weapons. I don't care. They're going to die soon enough. Fortunately, I'm going to have to take that hit. Ow. Not great. However, their ship goes silent, and you're relieved to know that you are still one hep, one hep ahead of the fleet. One hep. Just one. Alright, close everything. Reopen. Nathan, start working on that. Recall our friends. Ten, you're going to start repairing everything back there. Maxwell and Adrian are the only ones injured. Go ahead and go to medbay. Keep teleporting to my cloaking area. Maybe I should actually have somebody stationed there. Eh, hell. Cloaking is back partially online. And fully back online. Go ahead and go back to positions. So in general, I like keeping cloaking one pip instead of two pips. And the reason being that... Um, Whatchamacallit, um, usually I'm just trying to dodge a series of attacks rather than trying to stay cloaked to charge up my weapons, since I'm boarding. I'm not really using it to buy time, I'm using it to dodge. So it's less important to me. 
exit time. You spot a small rebel ship nearby. Seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. Doesn't seem to want to engage you in your ship. Yeah, well, you're gonna anyway. Oh, and you have a teleporter. How, how cute. Oh, hey, look, they're trying to escape. Who would have guessed? You're joining us. We're teleporting in there again. Maxwell, lockdown. Hey, look, they didn't get to teleport this time. Tee hee. Yeah, that's going to be a dodge from me, thanks. Ah, they actually did teleport in. Bastards. I didn't notice. I can fight in the healing chamber, that's fine. Everybody to weapons, because ow. <laughs> this is gonna hurt. Mm, yep, yeah, that's directly onto shields. Ow. Hot. The two of them decided to go fight in there. You need to actually repair teleporter so I can get people back home. Good enough. Adrian has 29 hit points. They have two. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Did it. What is it, is it? Searching the remains, you find that the cargo was military-grade drone schematics. You bring them aboard to install on your ship. That hurt. That sucked. You need he Everybody needs healing. <sighs> Maxwell. Justin. Nathan, you can start walking through. Tien, time to start your tour of repair again. At about 39 minutes, okay. We have a kitty. That's really the important part here. Okay. That's repairing. I am actually going to have Ten be the repair master, so I'm just going to have Ten repair everything. Darker, report to medbay. You need healing. To 10, please continue repairing. I probably need more shields now. Okay. Ready to go back into position. Close doors, jump. Because Mantis Homeworlds. Oh, this might suck. I need better hull. <laughs> Is there a store here? No. Okay. So there's one store in the sector. It could be right next to the starting position, which is why I always jump and then decide whether I'm going to spend. Uh, it's going to cost me 100 to bump up shields more. No. I don't have enough energy to actually put into that is the problem.
That may be a mistake. But I'm banking on the idea that there might be a repair of some variety coming up, and I'm going to need a little bit of scrap for it. Looks like a whole bunch of nothing. Uh, small rebel ship with transport. Cool. Hey, look, they're going to teleport over to me again. So. Oh, hey, look, they're running away again. Who would have guessed? Um, Xor weapons. Holy crap, look at all of those missiles. I am going to dodge your missiles. Thank you very much. <laughs> You're going into engines. Okay, good. They're actually all synchronized, so this will be relatively easy. Teleport into there. Maxwell, throw down lockdown again. They're in oxygen. It's not a great spot for me. So I'm going to just drop all of my air. Just all of it. I have to keep that person there is the problem. Axor. And cloak. Still got hit. Damn it. Right, their teleportation bay is borked. Borrow a little bit of air. We're going after drone control, which is not great. I can distract them for a little bit at least, but I'm not going to be able to take them on. Group do I want to recall? All them. Felicity, go ahead and throw out a lockdown. You're gonna run. You're gonna come close. Down to four hall. I'm going to be dead. Yep. So close. Extra shields would not have helped. Extra engines would have. I got really unlucky on some of those rolls to hit me. Damn. Well, those two crew members survived. Nobody else did. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed this internet. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Okay, that's enough runs of FTL for a while.